Kazian, and welcome back, Snacks. <laughs> probably wondering why am I deciding to redo my room now since I'm moving for college in like two months and that is a very valid question to have I don't know if you've noticed but right above my bed there has been a blank wall there for the longest time and that's just one part of my room overall I've always felt for the longest time that my room has just been so unfinished there's been changes that I've always wanted to make or things that I want to add but I just never got around to doing it for some reason my logic is that I want to make my room the room that I've always wanted it to be before I leave I need to stop saying that I'm going to college you guys understand that and I need to stop okay so I let's get started Alright, so I lied. We're actually gonna go buy some stuff. But before I go shopping, I need to eat some food because I'm getting so angry. Like, you know, you know whenever you're so hungry that you're just in a bad mood? That is me right now. And I need to eat. I'm so hungry. <laughs> give you a quick little rundown of what my vision is for my room. My vision. First, the dresser area. I really like my dresser. There's nothing I want to change about it. Except I've wanted to change this mirror for the longest time and make it a bit smaller because I want to add some special little picture frames beside the mirror. Next is my bed first this little area here is perfect i want to change nothing about it and then above my bed i want to do the classic polaroid strip hanging off of a string thing above my bed and hang some pictures with my friends i'm definitely keeping the string lights on this wall but this wall has been blank forever and i definitely want to change that for my little desk area i like the little movie posters i have but I want to change the color of the frame because the shiny white bothers me so much for no reason. And lastly, the sitting area in my room. This wall here, I want to get rid of because it's just not my taste anymore. Personally, personally, I might play with some of the pillows here, but I'm definitely keeping the purple poop pillow. Fun fact, a fan gave that to me so long ago and it smells like grape and it still smells like grape and I love it so much. Thank you. I love having it in my room. That is my vision. Okay, first, we're getting some paint. I'm kind of nervous because paint stores are usually really quiet, and the whole point of this video is to take you guys with me shopping and talk about what I'm doing. Also, I brought my mask because COVID-19 is still a thing. I'm not even gonna lie. I kind of forgot that it was for a little bit, but it's still a thing, so here we go. Okay, let's go. What do I want? Hang on, there's so many yeah. options. Okay, so these are the colors I'm getting. I'm getting grasshopper. Grasshopper. Daffodil. Daffodil. Cheery. Cheery. Undercool. Undercool. Ember glow. Ember and glow. Oh, pistachio. Oh, pistachio. We got our paint. This is really heavy. So I bought two brushes, masking tape, and then six different colors of paint, and it came out to $54.69. I don't think that's that bad. And I saved $16. I don't know why I saved money, but I did. Okay, we made it to the next store. We're at Home Goods. Can you even read that? I'm looking for pillows. I'm looking for, a, I wanna buy a full ass mirror. I'm pretty sure they sell mirrors here and I want to buy one. And um, any other cute like interior, interior design stuff. Also, sorry I keep cursing. Get over it. Okay. <laughs> so I feel like most of the time in Home Goods, it's a hit or miss. So we'll see how this goes. So what am I looking for? Pillows? Are they going out of business? Why is there like nothing here? I'm looking for some pillows so far. This is the only pillow I've found, but this is so cute. These are the kind of pillows I'm looking for. Oh, I shouldn't touch it because COVID. Big sham pillows. So this is one option. There's also these, which aren't bad, but I don't know if it goes with my room. There's also this gray. I could get plain white and then get some like fun throw pillows like this bear one. 
Oh my God, look at me. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, so Home Goods has a lot of really cute pillows. I'm pretty sure Target does too. And one of my biggest fears is buying pillows and then finding cuter ones somewhere else. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh, let's get lost. Let's get lost together. I'm not buying that. Like, this is fun. What is behind this? Is this like a shell pattern? Oof. Okay, not gonna lie, that gives me tripophobia. Yeah, none of these really go with my room. I just kind of wanted like a simple circular mirror. Why do they gotta be so complicated? But like, yeah, in general, there's like not a lot of options. I wonder if it's because of COVID or if they're just going out of business. I don't think they're going out of business though. I think I'm just gonna look around a little bit more, see if there's anything that I really, really like. Otherwise, I'm gonna go to Target because I'm pretty sure Target has a lot of like similar-ish stuff too. I love Target. I'm not gonna lie, I literally, I hate wearing a mask so much, but I'm, I'm doing it for other people because I don't want to freak other people out. Even though more than half of the people in the store aren't wearing a mask either. Anyways. So while I'm in Target, I'm still looking for like room decor type-ish. Also, I need to buy as much Polaroid film that they sell, not like that much. I think I need like 50 or 100 total. Oh my God, Polaroid film is so expensive. Okay, look at this. Oh my gosh. Do you see this crap? <laughs> I'm not gonna get it. Here we go, here's all the bedding. Here's all of the bedding, okay. I needed some black picture frames. So here we go. I wanna do like a pattern, so like. I'm really gonna play on this on the floor, okay. Hang on. Yeah, if I do something like this, oh, let me show you. Something like that, I think that's cute. So I'm going to finish shopping here. When I get home, I can always just do a big haul because like, I don't know, sometimes like shopping and filming stresses me out because like I still want the result to be good and I like cannot focus. Love is easy to be more than friends. I love Camilla Cabello. Okay. I'm almost done shopping. Very last place I'm going to is Lowe's. I'm buying black spray paint and I really, really want to buy a new mirror. I have no idea if Lowe's even sells that kind of thing, but we're gonna look for it. If they don't, not that big of a deal, but I would really like it. Okay, hello. <gasps> look, there's little plants. I'm not gonna get any. Okay, sweet. I found a mirror. Let's go. Okay, so now that I'm home, why don't I give like a little haul of everything I bought? I honestly didn't buy that much stuff. I still wanna do a haul though. Disregarding the paint though, because I've already talked about the paint and it looks like this. Okay, okay, so first what I got from Home Goods. I got these gray sham pillows and also from Home Goods, I got this really cute bear canoe um pillow and i think it's so cute i don't really know if it matches my room but i don't care i love rivers and i love like kayaking and canoes so i this gave me good vibes and then the last thing i bought is this little tin can you read can you see it It says bone appetit but i'm gonna take some white tape and cover it so it literally just says tit i'm not even kidding okay so from target I got a bunch of Polaroid film because I want to string a bunch of Polaroids above my bed as so many people have and it's a very basic thing to do but I really like it. To be able to string up everything, I got these pins. Okay, these are things you put in the dryer that are shaped like a hedgehog. I actually got this from my brother Jordan because hedgehogs are his favorite animal and I saw it in I wanted to get it for him. So Jordan, if you're watching this video, I'm gonna ship this over to you. You guys saw this, but I also got a bunch of picture frames because I'm going to be making a fun family photo wall. I also got these two fake plants. I would love to take care of a real plant, but I just would not remember to take care of it. So I got these. And then lastly, I got this random storage bin and I'm gonna put my camera equipment in this because right now my camera equipment for my vlog camera is literally just chilling in its bag on the floor and I need to take better care of it. So I'm putting it into this. That's everything I bought. I honestly, didn't buy that much stuff. Okay, wait, that's not everything I got. Wait, hang on. 
I also got this mirror. Okay. <laughs> Welcome back, Snacks is Jazzy, and today, I don't know what we're doing. I <laughs> okay. I'm trying to remove this mirror off of this. I don't even know if it's possible though. Look at us! We're building, guys. Build building? <laughs> yeah, I don't want this mirror here. Okay, cool. But do I? I don't. Ew, why does it look like that inside of the thing? Because it's from the wall. Ew, I hate the way it looks. Awesome! Ooh. It's removable! Don't do that. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Bye, guys. Thank you, Joshua. Wow, my wall looks so ugly now because there's like crap busted on the wall. <laughs> to spray paint the ends of these poster boards. At first, I was just gonna buy completely new frames, but then I was like, that's way too complicated. These are fitted literally perfectly, like, so I'm just gonna spray paint them black because I'm not a fan. I just don't like the, the glossy white anymore. It just, I don't like the way it looks. I was also considering changing the actual poster, but then I was like, you know what? I still like these movies. Even though like I have new favorites, I still like these and I don't want to change that. I want to remember what movies I like. So now that they're all clean, okay, the awesome thing, the freaking, the awesome thing about these is that they flip up. I'm just taking some construction paper that we're not going to use and I'm gonna use this to cover up the poster. So I can spray paint safely. OMG, I'm nervous. Look at this. Look how crafty I am. OMG, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. It smells awful. <laughs> I'm getting so nervous right now that it's gonna bleed through the paper. It really looks like it is, but we'll see. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Uh -uh. <gasps> oh my gosh, we're good. We're in the clear. Okay, so for this dude, I ended up only spray painting the outside of it. The inside's gonna be filled anyways, but I think it looks kind of cool. Maybe it looks dumb, but oh well. I ran out of spray paint, so I think this looks cool anyway. So now we're just gonna wait overnight for everything to finish drying. Yeet skeet. So we have this dope projector thing where you put the image underneath and then you point it at the wall and then it projects the image and then I can trace it be and then I can paint it. This is the pattern I'm painting on my wall. I'm gonna paint the flowers different colors. Can you see that at all? I can see it pretty well for myself. Cause I'm in the room. Can you literally see this at all? Hello. It's just gonna be like a little strip because I want these lights to stay and I really don't want to paint underneath these lights. So pretty much I'm just tracing these on the wall. Okay, my trace game sucks. It's so bad. So now I'm actually gonna start painting. For the rest of this, whole painting thing, I kind of want to voice over it because I really just want to focus and paint. I really just want to focus and paint, guys. So pretty much all you have to know is I'm painting and I'm watching Princess and the Frog as I do so. Okay, let's paint. So basically I labeled each flower and what color I was painting it so that I wasn't going back and forth opening up paint and using the brushes. I wanted to be smart with it. And then I just went ahead and painted. I did what every other person would do whenever they paint a wall. Yeah, I just, I went ahead and painted. And unfortunately, I'm not gonna be showing you guys the full room tour reveal yet. You guys are gonna have to wait until Tuesday 
but I will be uploading my room tour, the final result, super duper soon. I'm sure a lot of you guys are really annoyed at me. I'm really sorry for leaving you hanging. My full room tour will be uploaded very soon, on Tuesday. But if you're watching this video past June 16th, 2020, then my room tour is already uploaded, so you can just go watch it. Isn't it crazy how life works like that? Okay. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below to be part of the snack pack because I post videos every single weekend. Make sure you follow me on all my social media because I'm always posting somewhere and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. And do you see this? Yeah. Keep your eyes open. Merch is going to come out soon. Bye. I promise we'll be all right Friends are meant for leaning I promise